Hello friends, so welcome to IT Kanpur and uh, I am your instructor for the course MTS 432A Introduction to Sampling Theory. Uh, my name is Shalab and uh, I am going to handle this uh, half semester course on the sampling theory. Now you know that is a very strange condition that is the first time in my life that I am going to teach all my students in this online mode. Means up to now, whenever you come to the campus, you enjoy the campus and I also enjoy your company also. So, and then when you are coming to the classes, we have different types of funds, but we both are going to miss it. But this that does not mean that we are lacking anything. Whenever there is a problem, there is an opportunity. So, this is an opportunity where you can train yourself to study to learn in a different way. And equally that is an equally important opportunity for me also. Means in the last 25 years I have been teaching in the inside the class using blackboard and everything, but now I have to teach in a different way. And that is the same story to you also that up to now right from your K G 1 or class 1 something like this, you are always going to the schools and uh, uh, means learning these things on the blackboard, green board, white board, whatever you want. But this is an opportunity, this is an opportunity for you to become a global student. That means, once you learn how to study in this mode you will have an opportunity to learn from any teacher in this world. Yeah, equally that is the same uh, opportunity for me also, means if I can learn how to teach through this online mode, possibly I can help many students. So, we are going to take it as a positive step toward the learning process. And we all are human being and that is the difference between a human and a virus. Humans are going to fight against the virus and I am sure that you will conquer it and very soon the day will come when you will arrive in the campus. Yeah, the campus is very beautiful and this campus life is a memorable part of your life, but then this is also a memorable part of your life and you are going to be the first batch of the student of IT Kanpur who will be learning the courses in an online mode. So, that is a plus point. Right. Now, about this course, you see this sampling theory is such a course which uh, many of you have done in your undergraduation also. And I have one issue that uh, in this course I have two types of students, one who are coming from the mathematics background and from my experience I know that these students might not have done this course in their undergraduate. And there are some students who already have done such a course in their undergraduate. So, now the thing is this, how are you, are we going to handle this situation and as a teacher, as an instructor, how I am going to help both the students. Well, when you used to come to my class, then I can talk to you, I can learn from you and I can understand from you and according to your need I can modify it. But now I have, I do not have this option because I am recording this studio before the start of the class, before, before the beginning of the semester. So, now I have only one option that in order to, to help both the students, those who have done this course in their undergraduate, in their BSc or not, I have to teach the entire thing. So, I will try to mark these lectures on the course web page that which of the chapters are going to be in your course. There will be some, uh, some elementary part which I believe that you already have done well for that uh, during the class possibly I will take not more than two classes. But now at this moment, I do not know that uh, what is the background of my student. So, I will be possibly I will be, uh, be taking some more time to explain you. So, I will try to make it complete. 
in case if you have done this course in uh, your UG, possibly you can leave one or two uh, lectures, but that is up to you. Means if you want to watch it, that will be that will actually help you more. And yeah, means just uh, watching them for one hour or two hours more, that will not harm you, but that will rather help you. Okay, so that is the objective. And uh, the biggest challenge for me is that you already have done this course. But now, what are you really going to learn new? So, but this is not your headache, this is my headache. In my personal experience, uh, after teaching this course a couple of times in the past, I know that uh, many students, they do understand how to do the algebra. But somehow, they miss the basic concepts. So, my emphasis in this course will be to attack on the basic fundamentals. And there is a good possibility that there are some topics which you might be knowing better than me, but I am not sure whether you really understand the basic fundamentals. For example, if I take the example of a ratio method of estimation, you all know that you have to define some epsilon and then uh, take the expression up to the second power of approximation and then try to take expectation and you will get each and everything. But if I ask you why do you do it and what is the basic fundamental behind those assumptions, those that methodology, that approximation, then possibly we miss may many time. So, now this is an opportunity to clarify those things. Beside those things, there is a difference, uh, means I personally feel that the way we teach at IT Kanpur and the way it is taught at other places. So, similar to sampling theory course, there will be some other courses also, which you might have to learn, but you have to change the approach in which you were learning it earlier. So, now this is such a course, which is trying to help you that this is the thing which you already have done it and now these are the thing which you are now doing now. So, you can compare both the things and that will help you not only in the sampling theory course, but in all the courses that you are going to attend in this semester to calibrate yourself that where do you stand, what do you know and, but now how you have to change your style. Right. So, with this objective, I will be doing this lecture. And in this course, what I have done, I do not have an opportunity to write on the blackboard or something like this, but I have here a pen. And using this pen, I can write on the computer. So, what I have done that I have prepared the slides. And I will try to explain you and then I will try to, uh, to write with this pen also wherever possible. I will try to explain you as much as I can in the given time frame. Okay. So, and beside these things, the notes of these lectures, they are also available. So, there is suppose there is one chapter on simple random sampling. So, here possibly I will be spending say uh, 4 or 5 lectures, but all those notes, they are also available on my course web page. So, you can download from there also. Now, the question comes, how are you going to ask me the questions? Well, for that, uh, I will send an email to you and I will share all my contact information, my email, my phone number, landline, uh, mobile, whatsapp, each and everything. And I give you an opportunity that you can contact me at any time 24 by 7. Yeah, just one request is that if you can avoid your question say in the night between say 12 o'clock till 7 o'clock in the morning, then I will be sleeping. But, uh, but if you think that there is some emergency, you can always call me at any time. Okay, so, that opportunity is with you. The only thing is this, when you write an email or something, just let me know that you are my student and you are the student in the, in this course. So, that will help me in uh, understanding your query in a better way. Possibly, I can call you, I can talk to you and if you want uh, me to call you, you can just uh, send me your contact number and I will call you surely. 
right and uh, the details of uh, these course uh, of this course and the course content lecture etc everything that will be available on the course web page and i'm sure that we are going to miss something in the type of things which you used to do in the class we used to laugh we, we used to enjoy but i'm sure that you will be coming to our campus to see us physically whenever the time comes and then we all will compensate all those losses that's my promise to you okay so now i will say once again welcome to iit kanpur welcome to this course welcome to my class and now we will begin with our first lecture that you can watch online and then you can download the pdf files you can also download the slides of the course which i am te teaching here in the pdf format so now you have everything and then in case if you feel that uh, well without a teacher you cannot learn ask me as a teacher as a faculty in the it kanpur this society this country expects many many things from us so we have to learn ourselves finally means in the next two years i will be possibly teaching you but once you go for phd or say any job you are going to face different types of problems which you have to solve yourself because i am not going to come with you so this is a wonderful opportunity for you to train yourself and you will be training yourself in a far much better way than any other student that's my promise to you so be confident be positive think positive and attend this course so once again i welcome you all and you start with the first lecture wish you all the best for this course and i wish you all get a good grade thank you